I saw this video of uh, Trayvon Diggs picking off Dak Prescott a couple of times and then talking yeah. trash to him. And I'm wondering, how often does that happen? If you threw an interception in practice, would yeah. the defense, like, really, you, you know, Trayvon Diggs was <laughs> not holding back. I mean, he was calling out Dak Prescott. Yeah, I've seen, I've seen the clip. I think, you know, those kind of things um, in that moment, I mean, you never know what went into it. And it's kind of funny because after those things happen at practice, you're already, like, you're already fine with the, your relationship with that player has already been mended, even if it were ever broken or frayed, I guess. And then you got to go talk to the media about it. And then they kind of remind you about it. So I wouldn't think it's not like, you know, he said that to Dak and Dak was just like tail between his legs, like a sad puppy and walking in a locker room, like, man, I got no friends. I don't think that's the case <laughs> at all. I think it's just incredibly competitive and, that kind of tense environment and that's what you want now you know people are going to have their take on it because it was cut out of context and then pasted everywhere for everyone to see but i don't see a problem with it and it also depends on the players like their relationship i mean bart scott used to rip my head off all the time i could barely get my first couple snap counts off because he's screaming at me yelling at me you know you, uh, Richie Valens looking La Bamba, mother, you know what, and this and that. And, uh, hey, Nacho, Nacho, hey, what's the snap count, Nacho? You know, he's screaming at me. And, um, you and, know, and I, Rex I Ryan didn't, to shout Rex didn't want to stop that. No, nah, come on. It was great. It was, it's, it's what your rookie quarterback goes through. And those are like oh, okay. the growing pains. But then, like, you know, a guy like that, like Bart. Dude's got your back. Like if anybody cheap shot at me or something, like that's the dude who would sprint on the field. Uh, same thing with Mangold. Same thing with those. Like they just have your back. And it's like, you know, this is a part of your growing pains, young guy, but you're one of us. You know, they, they got your their arm around you at the same time. A little different between Dak and Trayvon because they're, you know, similar age or Dak's a little older, whatever. So, uh, but but that's the way it's supposed to be. You're supposed to cultivate this environment that's so competitive that pushes you to the edge right when it's about to break out into a fight and then you literally just walk away or stand still and let them get the penalty. You know what I mean? That was like an old Pete Carroll thing. We push it to the brink, like right to the edge of the cliff and let them jump off. We don't jump off. We don't lose our cool. 